Hello, hello, gamer friends! I am here to show you our gaming room setup. This is the his and hers. First off, we got dual monitors for each of our stations, I guess. That was his and this is mine. And this shelf up here is just the perfect add-on for a lot of, of our favorite stuff. And you can tell which is which, right? My husband actually built both of our computers. I think we got the parts from Fry's. I'm not quite sure. But this was his olive green. And mine is the white. I love how this looks. It is so simplistic. These are really great for gaming. And it is a fraction of the cost if you would buy it from like Dell or whatever. Anyway, the floor is cord free. Because it is all organized in this cable organizer. You can check out all the shopping links below in this video description. If you love any of these. This is a monitor a desk stand this is really awesome because you can take off the stands from the original monitor and put this one so you can elevate it and you can organize and decorate under the monitors as you please like you see here this mechanical keyboard by redragon is really awesome i have this one with really cool lights that you can pick from but my favorite one is this one because every time i click or i mean type or play a game it goes crazy and starts strobing and it's like a strobing party in my keyboard and the way you can customize it is you press fn and a number and I think each number has three options. This specific keyboard does not have a number pad, but you could definitely choose one with it. I'll leave the link for that one below because I'd rather have that one too, but I can't buy no more. You cannot play a game without a gaming mouse. I love this one. It is so affordable and it's cute and it matches all my vibe. Speaking of affordable, these gaming headsets are really affordable if you cannot crushes you know like the turtle beaches <laughs> these are a great alternative this isn't really gaming but this is where i print all my photoshop stuff as well it is just the perfect place to put a printer and all the papers and all the photo papers and over here on the wall on top of it is my favorite matthew 2237 now that i've shared all the little details of everything i want to show you one last thing which is the coolest of all there are led light strips on that wall right there so i'm going to turn off the light and then bam how cool is this you guys my husband always finds these little extra special things that make the gaming experience more fun and by the way you can change the colors to this one but it's just blue right now because seahawks you can see my husband playing here he is playing a game called pub g i don't play it but i play this this is heroes of the Star. So what do you think so far about this cool little light? Isn't it just so cool? I love it! Ah! Anyway, we do play Heroes of the Storm together. This is one of Blizzard's MOBA game, which is a multiplayer online battle arena. My husband and I usually play after the kids are asleep because it is just the most relaxing, you know what I mean? But anyways, love this game. This is like quick games that lasts about from anywhere from 10 minutes to at most 30 minutes on those rare times but i have a few characters that i love this one is lily she is a healer you can actually go by the quest that is in this game to get some gold you know what i mean my favorite has to be sylvana she is just a fun a fun specialist character i play this one too Li Ming. she's an assassin but um to be honest, I just really love Sylvanas. And if you guys want to play a game with me or two, you can add my gamer tag. It is located right there. So add me, ZL Kazemi, 1800. Let's take a break and let's play. We did play World of Warcraft together before we had kids, and those were the days. So when Jujube and World of Warcraft had a collaboration together, so my gosh. If you don't know what Jujube is, Jujube is a diaper bag company not exclusive to parents, but for everyone, young, old, parents or not, you can use this. 
One of the most popular styles is this BRB, and it stands for Be Right Back, of course. This is a really nice bag for you to take to BlizzCon or anywhere you want to because it has so many compartments. This front pocket is called the Mommy Pocket for all of your stuff like sunglasses and even has a key fob. The pocket above that is the Tech Pocket, and this is where you would put your cell phone. There's another compartment here on the side and in here there is a change pad so if you are parents and you're using this for your child you could definitely use the change pad. Just look at all the characters over here. They are very nice and cute but deadly. If you are not using the change pad you could definitely take it out and use it later and replace it with this tote called be light this is really awesome because you can fold it since it's not structured i usually fold it twice and then just store it where the change bag it used to be grab that backpack and now you're ready for blizzcon mm -hmm. so when you're over there when when you see stuff that you want which is probably a lot you can take it out from your bag and be like i want this i want this oh and i want that too this mug is super cute. It has Tyrande and on the other side it has Silvana. She is my face. So satisfied. And when you're done shopping, you can just put your backpack on and the tilt because the handles are super long. The straps are so comfortable, you guys, and the back is padded. Happy shoulders! Let's take a look at the inside. The inside has so many compartments as well. I spot Murky. Do you see him anywhere? Oh, I almost forgot about these D-rings. You can attach it to strollers or if you don't use strollers, you can attach this super cute keychain. Salvanas, you are my girl. This is a cute way to Warcraftify your bag. Well, even more, that is. Alright guys, so that is it for all my game room setup. I hope you enjoyed these ideas on how to decorate your game room. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye! I was about to film our gaming room, well not the gaming room but like the gaming station I guess <laughs> and I tried to get in but somehow it got locked so I can't get in. I'm waiting for my husband to get home so he can <laughs> go up here in there through the loft with his ladder so hopefully that works. I don't know what happened but yeah I really have no idea what happened. This is gonna be crazy. Seriously? <laughs>